Baseball fans were over the moon to be allowed back into Xinzhuang Baseball Stadium on Friday after nearly four weeks in which the CPBL has played to empty stadiums. After careful deliberations, health officials decided it was safe for as many as 1,000 fans to enter the stadium, contingent on many hygiene restrictions. Fans were not allowed to eat or drink in the stadium and had to sit spaced out from each other. But the CPBL is delighted to be the first league in the world not only to hold games during the coronavirus pandemic, but to have all the fun of a real-life crowd. Let's now go to Xinjiang. Fans get their temperatures taken, use disinfectant gel, don entrance wristbands. The long-awaited return to the stadium is here. 1,000 fans streamed into the Fubang Guardian's Xinjiang Stadium on Friday. Despite lots of hygiene restrictions, nobody was grumbling. If I can get in, then nothing is too much hassle. You have to wear a mask, you can't eat or drink, you have to socially distance, you can't leave your seat, and you have to sign a hygiene statement. It's a special time and we really have to play our part. It's been so long since we could watch a game, so I feel it's really precious. The CPBL season opened on April 11, but with stadiums shut to fans. Online streaming brought in viewers from all around the world, as Taiwan was the only country with pro baseball still playing. Now on Friday, the CPBL is the first league to reopen to fans since the pandemic began. The league's secretary general, Feng Shengxian, says there's a lot more pressure now that fans are back in the picture. There's more pressure if we let the fans in compared to having the games closed. It means we have to be very careful about every step of the operation. If we do well, if this demo goes well, then other games can also gradually be open to fans. You need to let fans into the game to get the adrenaline and the tension up. We're the first league in the world to let fans back in. I want to thank Taiwan's government and our frontline health workers. Almost a month since the start of the season and finally these 1,000 lucky fans can get up and close to the action. The league says it will keep working with government officials to raise the cap on crowd numbers and eventually to loosen the stringent hygiene restrictions.